Hello, this is Kevin with 3G Store, and today I'm going to show you a simple way to improve campground Wi-Fi using Wi-Fi as WAN. Let's say that you're staying at the 3G Store campground, all the way back here. Free Wi-Fi is offered for all of the guests, but the access point is not powerful enough to reach you. A Wi-Fi as WAN device will not only help you pick up that signal, but it will also let you create a secure network of your own. Here are just a few of the options. First is the Pepwave Surf on the Go and the Pepwave Device Connector. The Surf on the Go is very small and compact and perfect for travel. On the back it has an antenna that is meant for picking up and receiving Wi-Fi. There is power and Ethernet. There is also a USB port for a cellular modem if Wi-Fi is not available. Estimated range of the Surf on the Go is about 150 feet. The larger option is the Pepwave Device Connector. Around the back you have the same type of connections including your power and your ethernet, however there is no backup connection for your cellular modem. Range on the device connector is much larger, to about a thousand feet or so. So now you have two different options with two different ranges with a little bit different feature set. What if you need a little bit more range though? The Wi-Fi antennas on the back of the Surf on the Go and device connector are removable. You can use a larger external Wi-Fi antenna, like this 9.5 inch full band. On the bottom of this it has a connector where you'll be attaching cable and then a mounting plate for putting on the outside of an RV on either a pole or a ladder. All you'll need to do is remove the existing antenna from the device connector or surf on the go and use a proper cable and adapter. You'll be mounting the device connector on the inside of your RV, running a cable outside and connecting the antenna from there. You have a larger antenna that is higher gain and is free of any interference from the rest of your RV. Other antenna options exist as well, like this smaller phantom antenna. Instead of bolting or clipping to the side of your RV, this is going to mount directly through the roof. If you want to keep your antenna low profile, but still maximize your Wi-Fi reach, this might be the setup for you. For more information, visit 3gstore.com, and for more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.